Michael Jordan is the most iconic basketball player to ever lace up a pair of sneakers. That's past, present, and the future. With his popularity and legend growing on the court, it also grew off the court with the popularity of the Air Jordan brand. Now I could talk about MJ all day, and I mean that literally, but today we're gonna talk about my top 10 Air Jordan models. I guarantee you won't agree with my 10, but it is what it is. Let's get into it. Number 10, the Air Jordan 3. The Air Jordan 3 was designed by Tinker Hatfield. It was the first Air Jordan 2 featured the Jumpman logo and a visible Air unit. Believe it or not, the Air Jordan 3 got a lot of popularity from the Spike Lee character Mars Blackman and of course the 89 dunk contest. Number 9, the Air Jordan 5. The Air Jordan 5 was designed by Tinker Hatfield and released in 1990. It has one of the most iconic tongues in the whole Jordan brand line. And not for nothing, but Will Smith gets a little kudos for helping these pop in the 90s for wearing them in a Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Number 8, Air Jordan 19. The Air Jordan 19 is designed by Tate Curbis and inspired by the Black Bomba Snake. Hey, lose my shoes. They released in 2004 after MJ retired in 2003. There's no hype, super underrated, definitely still top 10. Number seven, Air Jordan 6. The Air Jordan 6 was designed by Tinker Hatfield and was inspired by MJ Slant Nose Porsche. They made their debut in 1991 and Jordan won his first championship in the Air Jordan 6. Number six, the Air Jordan 14. The Air Jordan 14 was designed by Mark Smith and Tinker Hatfield. It was inspired by the Ferrari 550. They debuted in 1997 and they are most popular for being what MJ wore when he took the last shot against the Utah Jazz in the NBA Finals. Here's an honorable mention in the Air Jordan 4, which didn't quite make the list. The Air Jordan 4 was designed by Tinker Hatfield and released in 1989. They were held made popular by the shot that Jordan took over Craig Elo against Cleveland in the playoffs in 1989. And also because of Spike Lee's Mars Blackman character and the Nike campaign that they ran for the Air Jordan 4. This you can buy. You cannot do this. Can, can, can. Number five, the Air Jordan 16. The Air Jordan 16 was designed by Wilson Smith and made its debut in 2001. They were the first Jordan since the Air Jordan 2 to not be designed by Tinker Hatfield. It was said that the shroud made them uncomfortable to hoop in, but they still fired me and they had to make my list. Number four, the Air Jordan 1. The Air Jordan 1 was designed by Peter Moore. Most people think that it was designed by Tinker Hatfield, but it wasn't. RIP to Peter Moore. Although the Air Jordan 1 looks similar to the Air Force 1 and the Nike Dunk, it was considered a breakthrough design in 1985. The popularity of the Air Jordan 1 tapered off, but has caught a resurgence lately and is one of the most popular sneakers in the whole culture, but they still don't crack my top three. Number three, the Air Jordan 13. The Air Jordan 13 is designed by Tinker Hatfield and the inspiration is based on a Black Panther, not the movie, the animal. 
<laughs> these are the new Jordans. That's it, huh? Yeah, how much these cost, man? The movie He Got Game starred Denzel Washington and Jordan brand athlete Ray Allen helped make these shoes popular. And I don't care what nobody say, these top three all time. Number two, Air Jordan 12. The Air Jordan 12 was designed by Tinker Hatfield and debuted in 1996. The Air Jordan 12 had a lot of iconic moments, but top of those iconic moments, I put the AI crossover and I put the flu game. The Air Jordan 12 is a shoe that made me realize that I was in love with the shoe game. Number one, the Air Jordan 11. The Air Jordan 11 was designed by Tinker Hatfield. And to me, it's his best design. And it ain't even close. They debuted in 1996 where they made their big screen debut in Space Jam. This is easily number one and I'll argue with anyone until I'm blue in the face. Air Jordan 11 over everything. Don't forget what sells out at Christmas time, every year, on time. Well, that's my top 10 Air Jordan models. Tell me what you think in the comments below. Tell me what don't belong. Tell me where I'm tripping at. Give me all this, give me the whole scoop of where I'm messing up at, because I know y'all gonna pick it apart. <laughs> so, leave a comment below, subscribe, Share with your friends. I'm Stretch. Peace.